Ukrainian army liberated a large area in the south of the country from Russian occupation. Ukrainian defense forces are continuing to advance on the Bakhmut, Melitopol and Berdyansk fronts, liberating 37 square kilometers over the past week. Hanna Malia, Deputy Minister of Defense of Ukraine, wrote it on Telegram. Both offensive and defensive actions continue in the east. We are advancing on the Bakhmut front while the enemy continues to attack on the Lyman, Avdivka and Marinka sectors. The enemy is trying to force our troops out of their positions but is receiving a worthy repel. Heavy fighting is currently taking place there, she said. Malia added that last week, as a result of the improved operational situation and the levelling of the front line, the liberated area increased by 9 square kilometres. At the same time, the number of Russian attacks in the east doubled over the week. The occupiers fired 11,753 times in seven days, 6,457 the week before. In the south, the Ukrainian defense forces are advancing on the Melitopol and Berdyansk fronts, in particular in the areas of Novodarivka, Pryutny, Novodanilivka, Robotyne, Novosilka and Staromeorsk. Malia said that the defenders had succeeded on all fronts in the south, liberating 28.4 square kilometers over the past week. In total, the area liberated in the south has now reached 158.4 square kilometers.